we still have the cold temperatures remaining in our area. It's 39 degrees in Alpena, 40 degrees in Oscoda, even colder in Rogers City at 35 degrees. These cold temperatures are coming with winds out of the northwest at about 15 miles per hour in Alpena, 16 miles per hour in Rogers City. It's this northwest wind that's blowing in colder air. Winds are a little bit lighter in Oscoda at 9 miles per hour. So you can see here the snow showers that were affecting areas to our west earlier in the day coming off of Lake Michigan with drier air now beginning to move into the state. Those snow showers have diminished. We're still seeing mainly cloudy skies throughout our area. Tomorrow is also going to be mainly cloudy, but then we'll see some sunshine breaking out. Lots of disorganized bits and pieces of moisture, rain and snow showers out across parts of the Midwest. But what you're seeing here over the Dakotas and Nebraska will continue to move down towards the southeast and really not be an issue for our area. There is a stripe of snow affecting areas from the Indiana border up towards the Detroit area where they are seeing snow, but that's also all staying south of us. So as we go into tonight, we are going to have cold temperatures again with lows near 23 degrees in Alpena, 25 in Tawa City heading down down to 22 in Mayo with mostly cloudy skies and a light breeze out of the northwest. And then tomorrow, pretty similar to today. High temperatures about 40 degrees in Alpena, 39 degrees in Oscoda, 38 degrees in Rogers City. It's going to be mostly cloudy with winds coming out of the north northwest around 10 to 15 miles per hour. So the clouds remain in place as we go through the next 24 hours. We are going to be seeing mainly cloudy skies throughout our area. But then as we go into Thursday, we will have diminishing cloud cover, so we will see some uh, brighter skies developing for Thursday. Temperatures tonight heading into the lower and middle 20s. Highs tomorrow about 40 degrees. Then it's going to start getting warmer. That's because winds on Thursday will shift out of the west, so we start losing that influence of cold air out of the north. It's a cold start to Thursday morning, but by the afternoon, we'll have high temperatures close to 50 degrees, and then with winds out of the west-southwest, for Friday, it's going to get even warmer starting off around the lower 30s and then for Friday afternoon, we'll have high temperatures getting into the lower 60s. Our next cold front is going to move in Saturday, so that'll bring us slightly cooler temperatures with highs in the mid 50s Saturday and then upper 40s on Sunday. So for tomorrow, mostly cloudy. It's a cold start to the morning highs near 40 degrees. Thursday also starts cool, but it's going to be a bit brighter with highs near 50 degrees getting warmer on Friday with highs around 62 degrees. Then that incoming cold front on Saturday will bring us a chance of some rain showers during the afternoon and evening. Highs about 54 on Saturday. Sunday is going to be drier but also colder with highs near 49 degrees. Then next Monday we'll have mostly cloudy skies with high temperatures about 51 degrees. Temperatures look to warm up again heading into next Tuesday with highs around the lower 60s.